Good morning, good afternoon, good night, wherever you are. Welcome, welcome to my channel. This is uh, the third video, I believe now, in this series on Radio Button. My name is Matthew. Thank you for coming. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel for future videos. Uh, by all means, don't hesitate to share the videos. Okay, so what we're going to do now is we are going to add public properties, fields, and methods so that we can access and modify those um, the radio button properties outside of uh, the radio button itself. Uh, the first one we're going to work on is the is the boolean. So let us get started. Needs a getter. It's returning a type of bool, and say get value is selected property. Of course, we're going to get an error because that property has not yet been created but we'll get to that in a minute select a property copy and paste to avoid typos okay let us have it generate what we need for us shall we okay let's bring it a little bit closer I like it closer now this should be static read only and modify binding property that create okay is selected copy it's returning a type of bull <laughs> declaring type is of type radio button and our default value is always going to be false. Binding mode, we want that to be two-way. Okay, let us now create this uh, property change um, method. And for this one, all that we're doing is we're going to say control, var control is equal to, we're going to cast it as a radio button and then bindable. Okay, that's it. And then when we're done, we say if control is not null, okay, if control is not null, we're going to say control that is selected is equal to we're gonna cast it as a boolean new value okay now here's another step that we have not done uh, we're gonna take care of that right now and uh, gonna add a method that we're going to use several times so it's going to be control that update that's what we're gonna call it okay of course there's a an error message here why because we have not created control that update so let us do that uh, let us do void that update okay that's it void that update and boom magically disappears well thank you guys this is the end of this uh video um thank you for watching my name is matthew don't forget to hit share like subscribe for more videos if you like what you've seen so far leave a comment and i'll see you on the next video